Welcome to our channel. Kim Kardashian and Chris Humphreys took us inside their honeymoon one month before divorce news. Before their 72-day marriage came to an end, Kim Kardashian and Chris Humphreys managed to take us inside their Italian honeymoon. The pair landed on the cover of a September 2011 issue of Us Weekly, posing for a sexy photo shoot during their romantic getaway. Kardashian, now 43, and Humphreys, now 39, jetted to Italy following their fairy tale wedding and shared all the details with us, even hinting that they were ready to start a family. Kardashian and Humphreys began dating in late 2010 and were engaged by the following May. Reality TV fans watched the twosome walk down the aisle on season 6 of Keeping Up with the Kardashians. Us recently rewatched the dramatic two episode wedding special, which begins with the announcement of the duo's divorce after just 72 days of marriage. On October 31, 2011, Kim Kardashian filed for divorce from Chris Humphreys, read a message at the start of each episode. She released the following statement. After careful consideration, I have decided to end my marriage. I hope everyone understands this was not an easy decision. I had hoped this marriage was forever, but sometimes things don't work out as planned. We remain friends and wish each other the best. The former couple, who didn't quite remain friends, reached a settlement in April 2013, finalizing their divorce two months later. Elsewhere in Ye Old Us, Jennifer Aniston purchased a $21 million compound in Bel Air on the heels of her romance with Justin Theroux. While their relationship didn't last, the pair were married from 2015 to 2017. Aniston's love for the property has stood the test of time. More than a decade later, she still calls it home. Jessica Biel and Justin Timberlake were on the rocks in early 2011 amid rumors of infidelity but the couple were back on track by the summer. They were engaged before the new year and tied the knot in Italy in October 2012, eventually welcoming two sons. Sarah Michelle Gellar's return to TV was also featured on the cover of Us in 2011, eight years after the end of Buffy the Vampire Slayer. She starred as twin sisters Bridget and Kelly on The Siege of the Ringer, but the series was cancelled after only one season. 